Welcome to Economics for Students. In this video, we are going to discuss in detail why production possibility curve slopes downward. In this figure, we observe that production possibility curve slopes downward from left to right. This is because the PPC is drawn on the assumption of full utilization of resources. So, if we want to increase the production of one good, we will have to reduce the production of other good. Let us understand this concept with the help of a simple example. Suppose there are 10 laborers in the economy. 5 are employed in the production of rice and remaining 5 for the production of cloth. And they are producing 2 units of cloth and 7 units of rice at point C on the production possibility curve. Now, if we want to increase the production of cloth to 3 units, then we have to shift one labor from rice production to cloth production. So now with 6 labors, cloth production will increase to 3 units and rice production will reduce to 4 units with less amount of labors. And the economy will now produce 3 units of cloth and 4 units of rice and move to point D on production possibility curve. Therefore, the economy has to sacrifice the production of 3 units of rice in order to produce 1 extra unit of cloth, which makes the PPC downward sloping.